Hello everyone. Today marks the release of the highly anticipated Star Wars, Jedi, Survivor game. While the game looks stunning, recent footage has revealed some concerning performance issues plaguing the PC version. These issues include micro stuttering, low frame rates, and sky-high VRAM usage with the game sometimes going beyond 21 gigabytes of usage. Eckhart's Ladder and GameStar on YouTube shared their experiences with the game and their videos have stirred up quite the buzz. One of their major concerns was that the game at times was unable to reach the desired 60 frames per second. Even those with top-of-the-line GPUs such as the RTX 3080T and RTX 4090 were unable to hit 60 FPS. Fortunately, developer EA and Respawn have acknowledged these problems and have released a launch day patch to address these issues. Additionally, Eckhart's Ladder and other players have noted that Respawn has been pushing new patches regularly to the pre-released version of Jedi Survivor to fix these same performance problems. For those with GeForce graphics cards, NVIDIA also pushed out a new game-ready driver recently that adds optimizations for Jedi Survivor to boost performance on NVIDIA GPUs. This means that these performance issues should be fixed or drastically improved when the game officially releases. Console players should not have to worry about any of these performance issues as they should remain unaffected. EA lists the recommended system requirements at an RTX 2060 and 8GB of VRAM as the minimum, with a DX12 supported GPU as a recommended feature. Star Wars Jedi Survivor will be available to play on PC, PlayStation 5 and the Xbox series. Those who pre-ordered the game, or rented it through EA Play Pro are able to preload the game right now. With the game's whopping 130GB file size and 155GB storage requirement, it's definitely something to take note of. We hope that our review of the current state of the game will be useful in determining whether to purchase the game. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in a galaxy far, far away.